How you guys are doing? Good. How are you, Steve? I I cannot complain. Um, so I, I have a lot I want to ask you guys about uh, with Honest Thief, but um, I have an individual question for each of you prior to getting started. Uh, for uh, Kate, I have to ask you, um, how many of your costumes in Umbrella Academy did you borrow? <laughs> um, I actually didn't keep any of them or borrow any of them. I returned them all graciously to Netflix. Um, they were, most of them involved a major corset of some kind, so they weren't the most comfortable. But uh, yeah, those are all archived. We hope to actually do a little tour with those at some point when the world opens up again. Uh, they were fantastic. And I will say that you really should try to get some, even, even okay. with the corset. Um, okay. Just throwing Thank that you. out there. And with, with Liam, I have to ask you, um, does it ever get old talking about love actually? No, it doesn't actually, strangely enough. No, it's just so nice to, um, it was just lovely to be a part of that film. Mm. Um, you know, a movie that starts, I'm just remembering, you're immediately gripped by that film because you hear Hugh Grant saying, as you see all these real passengers getting off airplanes and greeting each other, all the messages before the Twin Towers were murdered were messages of love. And once you hear that, that's the opening of love actually. And that still gets me. If I'm flicking channels and that comes on, I have to watch it. Not all of it, but I have to watch that. I think it's such a, an amazing opening. God, Liam, could you bring it any more down? <laughs> Jeez, sorry about that. I, I'll just say, I mean, I think for a lot of people, it's a favorite, uh, myself included. Um, jumping into why I get to talk to you guys today, um, you two had some great chemistry in this. Uh, were you guys, was this one of these like a super fun shoot? Was it a challenging shoot? How, how was it behind the scenes? We were in love. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm gonna say. Uh, uh, I have to say, no, it was, a, it was a joy to work with Kate. And I, I know that's a cliche, but it was an absolute joy. Uh, she's a great actress. She's funny. She's smart. She's very easy on the eye. And we just had a good time. And, yeah. you know, it's a story about two people of a certain age finding love, maybe for the first time, certainly for me, my character. And uh, just Kate just made it so easy. Also, Mark Williams made a great kind of easy set, right? And yeah. um, so it was just, oh yeah, it was just a blast. It feels like so long ago, but it was so, and um, you know, and the local crew and everybody was wonderful too, outside of Boston, Worcester, Massachusetts. It was, we had a, it was, that was, a, it was cool. It was cold. There were some cold moments, but not that cold. Not I mean, you you shot the gray, my God, this was nothing. This was like a, a tropical experience, I'm sure, compared to that. I was sweating. <laughs> um, yeah, but it was fun. Yeah, one of the things over the past decade, Liam, um, people have shown again and again, myself included, that they love watching you punch people in the face. Um, <laughs> it's it's really true, though. I mean, it's it's been 12 years since Taken, and and people love seeing you in action movies. What? Is there any secret to pulling the, like, is there something that you figured out as to why people love watching you punch people in the face? And, and Kate, what's your take on this? Well, there's a part of me that feels like a kid in a toy shop, to be honest, when I, I do these things. Uh, these fight scenes, I, I, I get to work out with these amazing stunt guys. I get to be with my stunt coordinator, Mark Van Slow. We've done, <clears throat> excuse me, 24 films together now. Um, and it's, yeah, it's like being a kid in a toy shop. We're learning a dance. We rehearse it, rehearse it, rehearse it. And um, of course, we don't actually, obviously, punch each other in the face, but uh, sometimes we'll get very close to it. It's just fun. It's fun. Sure. Yeah, I had, I don't, I mean, I think everybody loves to watch Liam be a hero and fight for the underdog and, um, I mean, I, I've always loved that, but I also, for me, it was really fun. That's one of the reasons I wanted to do this. There was a really fun fight scene for me. And I, I was like, oh, that, I was like, that sounds like a lot of fun other than this guy. Uh, yeah, it was really, 
<laughs> it was a, uh, it was a lot of fun. And Mark was amazing. Um, uh, Mark Van Sloan, who Liam's talking about, he was the stunt coordinator for the whole thing. And it was incredible. And it is like a dance and it's so precise. And, uh, and you have everybody else on the stunt team that just make, made me look good. And it was, uh, that was, that's a lot of fun though. It's a real adrenaline rush. Yeah. You, that was a really good fight scene in the um, storage unit place. Uh, you did a very good job. Um, for, for, this is my last question for each of you. I know that making any project, you're always going to have a day or two that you'll always remember, whether it be because you effed up, whether it be because it was just a great day. When you think back on the making of this film, like what's a day or two that you will always remember? You know, I'll have to be honest. Every day was kind of special. It really was. I, I, I just, I, you know, making movies is probably one of the great joys in life if you're an actor. And, uh, you know, when you reach a certain age, I was 66, I'm 68 now, I was 66 when I made that. And I kept think, nipping myself in the arms and how lucky you are to be doing this, acting with this lovely lady, getting to do fight scenes. And it's, uh, but truly, Steve, every, every day was, was kind of a joy. I remember the first day I was about to, it was when we were shooting at the house, Liam, and I was about to make the, the entrance on the porch, I was waiting out on the porch and I thought, oh my God, here we are. I'm making a movie. I'm with Liam. I'm like, oh my God, I'm about to go into my house. And you do still feel like a kid. Like you just feel a little dorky and like excited, like a, a kid at Christmas a little. Um, uh, and that's a great feeling, you know, no matter what age, it's like, okay, it still feels brand new. Yeah. And uh, so I feel very, very lucky and grateful. We had a great, what a, yeah, now I'm like, oh my gosh, can we go back there? Especially now it's very, uh, Makes me very wistful. On that note, I just want to say congrats on the movie. Thank you both so much of your time for your time Thanks. and enjoy the rest of the speed dating. <laughs> okay, thank you.